Hi, so this is our final update on the power kit and the custom tuning and mechanical mods of this O2 Subaru WRX wagon. And I've got the graph in my hand, but let's put the graph on this video and we'll talk about the final run. And we'll show you a picture of what the car looked like on the dyno. Unfortunately, I forgot to get the video when we did a power run, but the graph speaks for itself. So you'll see on the left-hand side of the graph, You've got torque measured in newton meters at the hubs and that's the blue line so if we look at around 3200 rpm at the bottom of the uh, graph at rpm that's now peak torque at just about 300 to 320 newton meters but if you look down below there you see the original factory peak torque of say 3000 rpm is only a little bit over 150 Newton meters, so we're well and truly doubled the peak torque of the capacity of this engine performance with a good reliable tune and a good quality exhaust. But let's just have a look at how long the torque lasts for. So if you look at that top blue graph again, above 300 Newton meters, it stays at 300 Newton meters all the way to 5,000 RPM. But of course, the original factory tune has already dropped off peak torque at 5,000 RPM and is only 225. But the car now has still got over 300. So let's just talk about power because remember torque is what makes a car feel quick and this particular car will be a lot quicker to drive and a lot more fun to drive. So peak power on this particular model car we got around 167 kilowatts at the hubs whereas factory standard of 5600 it was only about 130. Now depending on where you want to measure it on the graph the peak increase in power is actually at 4800 rpm where it was at 120 kilowatts whereas the car if you look at that graph, is certainly around you know, 150, 160. So the um, interesting thing also, look at the blue lines as it approaches 6,000 RPM. You can see the car's acceleration or torque is starting to drop off. And that is where you start revving the car unnecessarily when you should be changing gears for a lot more fun to drive. So that's the upshot and the summary of this um, particular model car. I know the owner of the car is particularly pleased to look forward to driving it more and I'm sure whether you are in the world with these modifications or if you choose MRT Performance we'd love to provide them for you here both in Sydney and around Australia through our partner tuning network. Please contact us so we can help you wherever you are at home with custom tuning with our remote tuning network as well. Of course check out our new website mrttuned.com.au with some great new updates as well. But for now my name is Brett Middleton. Thanks for watching.